How are you doing, sir? Good, how are you? We keep running into each other. Yeah, it's the third time in 24 hours. Okay. Just talk to the manager, they don't want you here. I was invited by people who live here. But if the manager said I have to go, then I gotta go. But did you just go oh. solicit a trespass? Is that what you did? I asked her if you wanted her here on the property. So okay, so you solicited leave. trespass. Hey guys, how are you? Okay guys, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and share these videos. And go to my backup channel called Omaha Cop Watch Live. The link will be in the description. So this, this is the same officer, but two different videos. You will see how corrupt she is. She tried to have both men detained and both men trespass for exercising their constitutional rights. This lady officer is something else. All original links will be in the description. And remember, go to my Facebook page as I'm trying to reach 10,000 followers and it's Omaha Cop Watch slash YouTube. I repeat, Omaha Cop Watch slash YouTube. All the links will be in the description. So guys, always film the police because you cannot trust their word. All they do is lie and the only truth to there is to film them because the video never lies. Video unedited raw encounters never lie so always from the police i'm out guys peace she's one of them ones she's gonna pop off one day yeah pop off and killing a black person maybe see i'm the only one said that you feel like she gotta have to see maybe she cocky too yeah he ain't said nothing we've been sitting here the whole time I'm glad you don't want to feel the bad. Please be quiet. Because I feel the bad too. Yeah. She cocky as shit. Only because she's a police officer. Stop before she lays down. This lady officer is about to come down the stairs and try to solicit a trespass. She's about to go talk to the manager to get this guy to leave. That's some of the things that the police officers, they always have a trick up their sleeve. I'm from Chicago. Good, how are you? Keep running into each other. Yeah, it's the third time in 24 hours. Okay. Just talk to the manager, they don't want you here. So I was invited by people who live here. But if the manager said I have to go, then I gotta go. But did you just go oh. solicit a trespass? Is that what you did? I asked her if you wanted her here on the property. So okay, so you solicited leave. trespass. Thank you for leaving. Thank you. I will be leaving. I'm going straight to the police department to file a complaint on you for soliciting a trespass. She, she's not supposed to be able to do that. They're not. That's, she, she only did that because she know she know you. She yeah. She seen you. Yeah. She know you. She know. She know. She know. Manager? Ma'am? Yeah. Um, from what I understand, that police officer asked you if you wanted me to leave? Yes, yeah, The to people that live over there asked me to film it so in case something happened. Is that alright? I have a better people of the night. I'm and sorry? Please, if, as long as you don't live here, you can't be in the premises. Well, yeah, but somebody that does live here asked me to film so that they would have a documentation of it. Say again. Uh, the people that live over there, they're they're still down there. I don't know their names. I just asked them if it was okay if I filmed, and they said please do. They they wanted a record of it. The, you don't think I should be? Is that what you're saying? Okay, so if something happens and there's no record of it, I mean, are you gonna feel bad? Things happen all the time, you know. All right, well, I appreciate you. Uh, what that officer just did, though, is illegal. She's not supposed to solicit a trespass. If you had seen me down there and then went to her and asked me to leave, that would be one thing. But uh, she actually 
uh, came to you, and that's kind of illegal. But if you're asking me to leave, I will leave. Thank you. Well, I appreciate your time. Thank you. that so we'll film from the sidewalk can I uh, get that sergeant the female sergeant's name and badge number please uh, as soon as we can as soon as practical we can give you whatever you need okay I need it for, to file a complaint actually okay yeah like I said as soon as as soon as practical you can stand by out here Yeah. Hey, uh, Sergeant. Sergeant, I'm going to need your name and badge number before you leave. In writing, do you have a card? So this sergeant is absolute trash, and I will be looking for her out there when I'm out filming, and I will allow her to kill her own career. I'm sure it won't take long. Okay, guys, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and share these videos. And go to the go to the original links in the description, guys. All right. So this man was filming at the police department, exercising his first amendment rights. The police comes out and they mess with this guy. This man knows his rights, and he goes and he films the police. He is a new auditor. Go check out his channel. And if one more thing, if you guys want to see silent treatment audits, let's get 500 subscribers. All right, let's get 500 new subscribers and I will start doing silent audits. That means I won't talk at all. So hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, share these videos. And I'm out of here. Peace out. catch up because all the way over there now. <laughs> I was standing there for 20 minutes. I need to spend like hours just to stand around just to uh, see a cop. <laughs> well, let's go into this room, guys. Not into it, but outside of the door. Then we're going to go to the side again. And then that'll be it. Okay, so far, it's So far it's quiet, and I think they're here. I think it's nice though. Hello sir, can I help you? What's that? Can I help you? I'm just looking around. Just... Can I ask why you're filming our facility? Oh, it's pretty, looks pretty cool actually because of the washing and everything. Uh-huh. kind of curious how this this whole thing began, you know. Okay. <laughs> you want to come up here and chat with me a little bit? Am I? Do you mind? Am I detained or? I just need to talk to you because you've been filming our officers so in and out, so. I and I can't do that? With that? Huh? And I can't do that? I mean, I was in a public area, so. Okay. What's your name? I don't want to give you my name unless I'm, I'm being thrown up arrest. So. Am I under arrest or is it? You're not under arrest. What's your, what's your name? Why are you filming our facility? I just told you, I like the history around this place right here. Okay, well, while you're talking to me, you got a baton here, I'm just uh, gonna hang on to it. Why are you while touching I'm me? I'm talking to you, okay? Why are you touching me? It's for my safety while I'm chatting with you. Well, I'm okay. here, I'm not gonna do any harm with you guys. Okay. So, what's your name and badge number? It's 51079, and what was your name? What was your name? It's Sergeant Buchanan. Badge number? I already gave it to you. Okay. 
What's your name and badge number? I'm sorry, sir. I'm having a hard time hearing you. What's your name and badge number? Sure. My name's Officer Apodaca. My badge number is 10-0-0-4-0. Right. I just want to know why she touched me. I, I just so, walked out here. I don't know what's going on. I'm just over here doing a story. Okay. Trying to, you know, in a public area, try to uh, record everything around here. I mean, I saw this wash right here. I'm saying, it's pretty cool. You know, I don't know what this whole thing started. Like the wash is being here or the police station was here first. That's all I was trying to figure out to look around the public areas. Okay. So you're touching me, I, but I want to know why. Because you think I'm a threat? Because I'm doing the story or? You got a baton on your hip, sir. Yeah, it's for uh, protection, not from you sure guys. That I'm safe and that you're safe. We don't have oh, any trust issues. me. That's why I'm right here, okay. you know, away from you. <laughs> Can you explain to me why you're filming over here? Because I like to film in public areas, so public area, right? Okay. Well, I'm going to detain you right now. So oh we investigate, God. okay? Really? I don't know what's going on. In a public like area, I'm okay. being detained. Okay, I'm so back we're going to figure that out. I don't want your camera to get broken. I'm just going to hold on to it. I'm recording this incident as well. There's breakable stuff in there, you know that, right? I have more cameras in the back. Okay. This is ridiculous. In a public area. All right, we'll figure out what's going on. Right now, I'm detaining you until we figure out what's going on. Okay, I'm gonna hang Whoa. on to this while I'm talking to you. All right, dude, I can still search his seizures. All right, he's gonna hang on to your backpack. We're gonna walk up here. I'm not gonna search his seizures. Okay, I'm not searching you. I'm so. gonna pat you down for any further weapons. Do you have any more weapons on you? Yeah, we're still just trying to start. Okay. I have three boxes in my backpack just because of the skin of the pipe. Okay, I'm gonna check, make sure. Can you point it this way, please? Yeah, you got it. Mine's pointing this way too. You have a First Amendment auditor or something? Public area. I hear you. I hear you. I'm a Vikings fan too. I know it doesn't mean much to you right now, but. It's the first time I've ever been to K. So what's the issue here? Well, you're, you're um, on our facility. Videotaping police operations. So, hmm? I wasn't. You said it was in a public area. I was told you were over here, standing on our property, filming, filming so this operations over, over here. Yeah. I know the, the sign is right there, but I didn't go past the sign. Okay. So. We're okay. going to review our cameras, and and if you if that if we got some wrong information, and that indeed is the case, and as I understand it, you might be out of handcuffs here in a second. But it sounds like a crime was reported to us that you were trespassing on. I was not trespassing. Was okay, well that's what was reported to us, right? I think we'll talk to so, so we got so. we got to investigate it if it's reported to us, right? We can't take any anybody's side in anything like that. So so that's why you're detained today. Okay. I know you guys got cameras everywhere, so check yeah, those. We're, I'm going to be checking them. Um, I don't know how to work this system, but I'm going to find somebody who does. And we're going to be working on that. Okay. What's your name, sir? I'm like, I'm like, I did nothing wrong. Okay. Nothing wrong. Okay. Right here, you man. You're just if you're just out here filming, it's obviously a public area. So and you're right there on the track. So the the track is public as well. Yeah. But what it sounds like was reported to my sergeant is that you were on our private drive past the no trespassing and signs. While you're detained, I'm going to go verify that information. Okay. And I'll be right back. Back there, I was lifting that up so I could look over the wall. Sorry, say it again? I lift that up so I could look over the wall. That's about it. Look, look over this wall or? This wall over here. Okay. Where the track is. Okay. <laughs> I hear you, man. Like, you're, you're able to do your, your odd person of honor thing, man. I don't have to talk to many people out here that have done that at this station and we've had no problems. Sounds like what was reported to us is it was a crime. If there was no crime actually committed, and it was a misunderstanding or miscommunication on our part, then we're going to apologize and take you out of handcuffs in just a moment. Okay. First time being in handcuffs, actually. <laughs> Sorry, what's that? This is my first time being in handcuffs, actually. Okay. Well, please, just for another minute. I've been to what, the one on downtown. 
the major one? The main station? Yeah, 270 South Stone. Yeah, they, they don't do shit like this. I hear you, man, and it sounds like uh, we wouldn't be putting you in handcuffs if we didn't have the report that you were trespassing on the private drive. I did not whip Cause it, this, And this isn't anything um, that we're saying you did, but we, for whatever reason, have had people try and sneak in that drive. We had somebody um, a couple months ago, we don't know how they got in our secure lot, but they were in our secure lot, like walking around and scoping out our cars and stuff like that, but they weren't on the cameras. They had either jumped over the back wall or snuck in through one of the gates, but they had been there. We reviewed cameras for hours. He had been back there for like three hours, like hiding under cars and stuff like that. So we've had security issues here, which is obviously concerning. I'm not saying you did any of that, but you can understand like how that kind of puts us in that frame of mind when we get, hey, there's some dude walking in our private drive back here. Hey, now he's out front. And my sergeant came out to talk to you for that reason. So what's that? Uh Private property line there. I mean, there's just a track, and there's just like a little bit of dirt right there on the side. Is that your property too? Next to the track? Yeah, next to the track. Like I that, don't. Re I just like talk dirt. to people out there. I don't really push it. If but if they're out like on the private drive walking, I've had. Oh, I've stopped. Right. I've stopped people trying to come in our gates uh, many many times. That right here. I'm talking about the corner. Um, can you want me to pick that up yeah. so it doesn't get damaged? Yeah, you got it. Is there a way for me to set this up so I don't have to... Yeah, just put, uh, you have a three legs right there? Oh, these are three legs? Yeah, three legs. Pull it out. Oh, that's pretty sweet, dude. Yeah, the, it doesn't have the three rocks in my back. Yeah, so well, it, it's not going to fall over like that, right? No. It's fine? That's fine. Okay. Um, I don't want to damage anything. Is you think that's okay? That's okay. Okay. Which area are we talking about? Are we talking about? Well, I can't remember the point. This area right here. Um, where, uh, on the back side there? Yeah, where the gate is, but the back. So it, it's, it's technically it's all like the property of the, of the facility of the city of Tucson. The track um, is? But as far as, not necessarily the track, okay, but I'm talking about was. specifically like this private drive and, and this like once here? you go through the behind the sign. Sorry, what's that? I was behind the sign, behind the sign right here. Oh. Behind the sign this way or behind the sign that way? That way. Behind the sign on the wall. Yeah. Um, Alright, it sounds like um, once we clarify that, we'll take out a couple of the small minutes. I'm fine with you walking around the whole station, filming everything. It's just, a, it's just, it sounds like we had a report that you were on a private drive. Obviously, she was too aggressive. <laughs> Sorry, what's that? Because obviously, she wasn't too a little aggressive. Okay. <laughs> like I said, man, I, I had just walked up, so I don't really know what led up, what happened before I got there, right? I just heard her say on the radio, she was out with somebody on the front gangplank or grid or whatever, and I just came out here to make sure she was okay. I didn't know what was going on. So whatever she got before I was involved, she got before. Stuff, was she can't do that. Unless what? she has trouble with cars. What's that? Unless she grabbed my stuff, she can't do that. Well, you can be so, detained for reasonable suspicion, but... It, it's what's not, the crime, though? Uh, that's trespassing. Yeah, that's what we had reported to us. That's a trespass. Well, if you, if you indeed did not trespass, or even if you did, we might just warn you. Um, if, if we look up on cameras, I'm not saying you're lying. I'm just saying, I mean, for instance, for instance, we looked on cameras and saw you. Oh, you were actually past the sign. Oh, you were close to the. It's not a sign, I'm but just giving you a for right instance. There. We're just having a conversation, right? So, um, so, so we end up that. talking to our, our witness or whoever told told us about this, and they say, oh, he was past past the. He would pass the thing, you can pass the sign, we look at video cameras, see your pass the sign, we might just tell you, like, hey, don't do that again. With the modern handcuffs, I could show you guys where I was. Okay. I hear you. We're trying to talk <laughs> to the witness to try and speed that up. We're trying to get trying to get oh, you out, yeah. out of cuffs as soon as possible. Officer Dial, I like the soap. So he was just doing a first amendment audit, just um, walking around filming. Um, what, at least as I understand it, uh, was reported to Sarge is that he was on the private drive back here. Oh, it's behind the sign. So, yeah, I told him if you need one behind the sign, we're going to take kind of answer for small ones. Sounds good. Just so you know where we're at. 
Come here, come here off like this. What's that? Come here, come share with the camera like this. It has happened from time to time, yeah. And we let them film. Um, I've had people. Obviously not. Well, well, <laughs> like I said, we it wouldn't be a problem if we didn't have the report that you were on the private drive. Because I had, I did explain to you earlier that we had people try and sneak in there, and we had that dude hang out back yeah. there for like six hours. I'm gonna do it with the camera and brought daylight. Dude, you would be surprised what I've seen people do in broad daylight. We just came. We just came from a call. A, a guy was uh, hit a girl in the elbow with a bat after she came at him with a knife. Well, it was last oh. month or so we had a dude come in here and try to hit the officer on the other side of the glass, smashing all our windows. Yeah. So that's um, overdose. Not a camera. Yeah, I hear you. Yeah, <laughs> we don't know you, do we? But, but like, like I said, sir. Right. I'm sorry, I didn't catch your name. But like I said, um, if, how did you get it? Okay. Right. Well, that, that'd be why. So, um, <laughs> so, like I said, if if everything you're telling us is true, then you're going to be out of cuffs, but we had to report the crime, so that's why you're detained. Alright, is this your earpiece? I'm going to just put this in your bag. I'm not looking inside or anything. I'm just putting it in there for our safety. Okay. So, turns out that it was misinformation on my part and miscommunication. It sounds like you were on the sidewalk and you weren't on our property, so I'm going to let you go. To leave. See this, guys? Oh, wow. Honestly, man, he didn't really cook a good day anyway. The, we're close. I know. We don't do anything. <laughs> yeah, it's on Friday. Right, right. Internal Affairs, formerly Office of Internal Affairs, now Office of Professional Standards. Explain to them the situation. Can I pick this up? Yeah. Can I show you guys where I was? I, I would be happy to walk with you if you want to show me where you were. Okay. It sounds like um, we were able to confirm what you said anyway, but I'd be happy to walk with you. We were, we were able to confirm where you said you were, so uh, you're free to go. Have a good day, okay? Okay, you too. Did you want to show me? Yeah. Okay. You can walk behind me if you want. I'm not. What I do is story. You know, person from an audience. Mm -hmm. That's what I do. I go to public areas. I don't go over private areas. I hear you. <laughs> but her being aggressive like that right off the bat. Yeah, and, and like I said, <laughs> we, had, we had a report that a crime was committed, right? Right? Yeah. But a crime has not been committed. And, and it sounds like it was a miscommunication, so that's why we apologize for getting handcuffs. I don't break the law. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah. and that's what was reported to us, right? Uh, that's yep. What we to us. Okay. <clears throat> I was where that pole was, right there. Where the curb is? Yeah, where the curb is, right there. Okay. Yeah, that's where I that's was. That's totally fine. Yeah. That's the only place I was, so.